Okay, y'all, I, I was not expecting to drop another video so soon. I literally just got done recording my return video to YouTube, and I, I get the notification that One Piece Odyssey, the next One Piece open world RPG game, has a trailer. This video might come out before my return video. The, the stars are aligning, y'all. I was not expecting this. So we're just gonna jump straight in, man. I was, I, I was not expecting uh, this at all. Uh, yeah, let me go ahead and play it. There we go. Okay, so One Piece World Seeker was was cool, but the uh, wait, hold up. Okay, uh, I thought to myself, wasn't like three years ago when I designed the characters, but when I actually saw the game, wow, it felt like I was watching a movie. Okay, all right, and and it's the twenty fifth anniversary. Okay, we doing something here. We do we doing something now. The graphics look kind of nice. Now I will say the World Seeker graphics back then they were actually pretty good for an anime game. Uh, but wait, was that the Sunny? What you got for us, Oda? Hey yo. Okay, for somebody to sink the Sunny, it had to be it had to be somebody, somebody different. It had to be somebody different to do that. Uh. Wow. A new One Piece RPG is on its way. Luffy and the crew, let's go. Luffy and the crew, let's go. Okay, so they all still look like the... Who is that? Is he a new crew member? Wow, okay. Okay. Wow. Okay, and they added climbing in this game? I know that's, that's a simple thing, but... Wow. And Wait, and we can use everybody... In the crew, because in World Seeker you could only use Luffy. Well, I guess and Zoro in, in the in the DL, DLC, but the hundred ton hammer from Usopp, K, Chopper, Robin, Frankie, Brooke. Is that an? That, that's got to be like a team ultimate or something. Wow, Smoker, to Time of Tears. Okay, the government, what they got, what they got going on. Let's travel to the heart of memories. Okay. Okay. One Piece Odyssey. All right. Okay, so there, there's a there's a couple things that I saw in there. Okay, I don't know who who that is, but I'm pretty sure it's somebody hype. But there's a, okay, so there's a couple things that I saw in that trailer. One, the biggest thing is that you can use everybody in the crew. You couldn't do that in World Seeker. I mean, you could use Zoro, you could use Law. He's not really in the crew, but you could use them in DLC and World Seeker. Uh, another big thing is the character design. I mean, or not character, but the uh, monster design. And we all know that One Piece. One Piece's animal and creature design and everything and art style is a little goofy, right? But if you are a big JRPG fan, RPG fan, and you play Dragon Quest, I think, I don't know if Toriyama, I didn't, I didn't see his name, I don't think, but I think they use the same engine or the same company that made, I, I don't know, I gotta I got do more research, I'm pretty sure they did, but if you play Dragon Quest XI, Literally all those monsters look like they came from Dragon Quest, which makes sense because they both have those silly monsters and enemies and stuff like that. So graphically is definitely a step up. Uh, I mean, I think they use the same models from World Seeker, but they updated it and it just looks amazing. Uh, Luffy can climb now. I know that it doesn't make sense because we know he could he could do the Spider-Man thing with his arms in World Seeker. Uh, we saw Team Ultimates. Everybody, everybody has an ultimate it looks like. Uh, I okay, so th this looks like the One Piece open world game that we we've always wanted, or at least all the One Piece fans have always wanted. Because World Seeker, it was cool. Uh, I will say the best thing about it was that they fit the One Piece vibe perfectly, or the game fit the One Piece vibe per 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 shit. But yeah, it fit the vibe perfectly. Uh, the 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 world, the characters, the new characters, everything like that in world seeker was perfect but as far as the gameplay in world seeker 
that was probably one of the worst games, I, worst anime games gameplay wise that I played because it just it was just a mess. It was a mess. Uh, Luffy's tack sometimes wouldn't hit. Uh, snipers would hit you from literally skyscrapers away and, and blocks away. From, I, it was a mess. If you play World Seeker, you know what I'm talking about. But uh, besides the gameplay, World Seeker was a good game, and it was like a stepping stone for something like this to come out where. This this could be something crazy. I was not expecting this to drop this year. My wallets are hurting some more because I, there was a lot of the video games that was coming out this year that are coming out this year that I'm gonna buy. I wasn't expecting to drop sixty dollars on an anime game. I this this looks like it's actually gonna be good. It has potential to be the best anime game we've had in a while. So I'm I'm in. I'm all in. And the timing of it is perfect with Joy Boy and, and the new. In the new chapter, they they timed this perfectly. They timed this perfectly. Everybody's been hyped about the new chapter. Uh, I'm not caught up in the manga, so it was a spoiler for me, but still, Gear 5th, uh, uh, crazy, crazy. They're, Oda, Oda's a smart man, man. He's a, he's a smart dude, but yeah. That's all. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna talk you guys' ears off anymore. Let me know in the comment section down below what do you guys think about this. Um, are you gonna get it? Are you not a One Piece fan? All that stuff. Let me know in the comment section down below. Um, that's all I have for you guys. Keep it real. See you guys in the next video. Peace.